bread team. Yeah. More bread! And they just eat dinner. Yeah. Who knows what they're talking about? I can't tell. Yeah. It is, um... It's that time, Red Team. No! I know. Yeah. Fight, fight, uh, fight the clock, though we tried. It is time for the final show of Joko Cruise 2019. Before we do that, it's time for the final morning announcements. Good morning, students! Good morning, Principal Soborin! <laughs> I'm gonna miss that until I hear it. I won't lie. You need a clean recording of that. <laughs> Just wake up to that every day. <laughs> That'll be my snooze. Well, my um, anyone who has lost anything, we've lost and found, is at It the... shall become found and lost at some point in the future. <laughs> Are you writing lyrics right now? <laughs> that's, a, that's what we're doing. <laughs> yes. Uh, if it has been lost, it, and if it has been found, or, or found, found and lost, <laughs> We're in a loop now. Somebody <laughs> control alt delete the show. Uh, uh, it will be at the ship's uh, guest services desk on deck one in the atrium. Do not come to the Joko Cruise info desk. I don't know if it even exists anymore at this it point. It is gone. It is gone. It's gone. It's gone. And it's gone. It's even if it has been destroyed. Even if <laughs> it is, it is, it is in the home. There has never been. Uh, but even if it, had, it still existed, it wouldn't have had your lost and found stuff, so, so check there. Also, the swag swap, is that still an ongoing concern? It is ongoing. If you have any merchandise uh, from, you know, free things you were given that you do not wish to take with you off the ship, but you just want to go straight in, don't want to go straight in the garbage, there are tables in the atrium, you can put it there. Those who want extra things can take them. If you leave them there, we will do our best to make sure that it gets properly donated and or recycled as applicable and, and possible. Um, it is now time for a very lengthy but important list of thank yous. And to start that off, we wanted to extend our uh, warmest and hugest of thanks to the, the ship's various departments on board. We'd like to bring all the department heads out and cruise director Becca Newton, where you can go ahead and take over from here. Over here. Yeah, 
she specifically requested this contract because she worked with all of you last year. She specifically requested not to work next year so she could be here with all of you. So thank you. Here. Nathan Sawaya, are you by any chance here or are you at dinner? He's not here, but not to specifically, I mean all of our performers and guests we love, but I wanted to specifically make mention of Nathan because he didn't have a lot of stage time or panel time per se this year, but he did, he went so far above and beyond the call of duty. He was on one of the first Joko cruises where he made the lifestyles uh, Jonathan Colton that used to sit uh, outside that door. Uh, and this year he blew us away with a 10 foot scale model of the Osterdam. <laughs> Thanks so much to Nathan. Uh, and we have a long list of uh, our, our own folks that we uh, want to thank, uh, starting with our four right hands, Anna, Stephanie, Tara, and Bob. Can we get the house lights? jokocruise.com emails throughout the year and who places each of you in your cabins who cares so much about this cruise she makes every list and she checks it twice at a minimum uh, we couldn't do this without Hannah thank you, thank you very much Hannah uh, all our tech crew and sound crew Mark Brazel, Chris Bailey up there in the booth Sarah Scrimshaw, our stage manager, Chris Paul, Eduardo, John Carter, also up there somewhere, Dana, back over there, Josh, uh, is Josh here? Josh, 
in, in addition to running all of the audio and tech in conjunction with Mark for every venue on the ship that is not this venue, uh, Josh also did uh, the vast majority of our broadcasts uh, converting and putting onto the, the online system and uh, all of the stuff that we preloaded, the videos and the, the, um, the all of that. So just, just give a lot of applause to Josh. This is great. For all the tabletop gaming, Jen Ellis, Keith Baker, and Cardboard Concierges. The world of crafting from Christine Fellows and Fiona's Fineries. Uh, all the console games came from uh, Michael Frey and World 9. Finish up the VR room that was uh, Daryl and Laura from Virtual Therapeutics. Thank you very much. Our ship listener, Colin Adamo. Less creepy than it sounds. Uh, Aaron Zipperly and uh, David Slivkin uh, uh, helped to sell merch and uh, do a lot of our marketing over the course of the year. Mike Palmer designs our, uh, develops, is our web developer. Kate Cantrell for all of her help with the Facebook crew. Yay! Uh, Steve Petricelli and the Shutter Monkeys. Uh, Liz Connor, who does our graphic design. Who is also married to my wife. I mean, I'm married to my wife. <laughs> It just got really complicated. <laughs> She's my wife's sister, I meant to say. <laughs> wife's sister, not sister wife. I don't have to <laughs> I catch him muttering that. As soon as I wake up. Wife's sister, not sister wife. Uh, Glenn, Ben, and Bill, the team behind Twitter. <laughs> It's a huge team, and thanks to all of them. Yeah. And Dustin, especially this year, we did a major part of the rewrite. I love a show where coders get applause. <laughs> that's, that's every Jonathan Colton hey, show. That's true. Hey, you know you're going to Jonathan Colton event win. Uh, this is such an essential part of what we do. Danielle Davis and the entire Lady Killer team. They were really crucial to making that uh, Giants show happen on the ship and, and, uh, and running that whole evening. Amazing. Uh, Paul Searle and the video team. Mark Maloney, our broadcast maven. This is a very large and crucial group of people. Nathaniel and all of the consultants and crew over here. Everyone who, who is a, a consultant, raise your hand so you can get a sense of how many people are working behind the scenes on this. These people were at the info desk, they were in the game library, and, and right now we pulled them away from their stations to be thanked. So that then everything can, is falling apart right now. Yes, they're gonna go back to they're gonna go back to frantically packing boxes in a second, but they're just pallets dropping off the back of the ship right now. <laughs> uh, special thanks to Nathaniel Grainer for arranging them. Thank you. So many helper monkeys and new monkey RAs. If you're out there, please stand up so we can see you. This is a big part of what makes this community work and hope it down. Greater than games. Uh, incredible help with our logistics, getting everything packed for Palatine. Uh, boxes, boxes, boxes. Uh, all of our sponsors. We love you all. <laughs> Our charter coordinator, Yan Basang. See here? There he is. Uh, Diana and Steve Bloss at Worldwide Cruise Associates. And a special shout out to Diana, who is 
Save Your Butts, the center one next. She's a cruise Jedi. Yeah. Thank you, Dan. Um, and uh, he's, uh, he's no longer with us, but we like to mention his name every time. Leon Benosian uh, uh, was our original uh, Worldwide Cruise uh, Associates uh, contact, and, and he really uh, was responsible for helping us get this thing, develop this thing into what it is today, and uh, we think about him every time we do one of these, and we wish he was here, and we know that he's looking down and smiling on it. And we, we knew, uh, like, if he had been here this year in San Juan, he would have been in the middle of the shit and loving it. <laughs> Thank you. That concludes our morning announcements. Um, I would personally like to thank Drew Westfall. Paul Saborn and Storm Di Costanzo. I, I thank I think I would like to thank all three of you, Drew and Paul and Storm. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. And I am just going to thank Jonathan. <laughs> oh, oh, thank you. Thank you, Pastor Thank you, Storm. <laughs>